Hello, hello, welcome everybody, welcome, welcome to the channel. A little bit of a different uh, video today, I'm doing an unboxing, but it's not really cycling related, well it is cycling related. Uh, I'm not on my bike at the moment because it's just too cold outside, it's freezing. I mean last night it was, when Katie came back from work it was minus nine. Uh, that is minus nine, yeah, freezing, freezing cold, horrible. Loads of snow still around, but I think it's supposed to get a bit warmer next week, so hopefully I'll get on my bike then. Yeah, uh, today I'm just uh, kind of hanging around the doors, you know, and doing bits and bobs in the house and enjoying my fire. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. It's one thing you live in a oldish house that you that you got a open fire. We have a another fire in the back as well, a coke fire, but this one's uh, this one's an open one's lovely. Anyway. I'm drifting off here. <laughs> yeah, as you can tell, I love me fire. But anyway, so yes, so today I've got an unboxing and I've bought myself a new camera. I've bought myself a GoPro 6 Black. It's um, It was an offer. It was on a good offer. It's a refurb, refurbished one. I'll put the um, the website up on the, well, not website, actually it's eBay, but I'll put the eBay page up on the on here for you to have a look at. Um, it comes from a, um, a well, actually, I, Looking at the site, it looks like it comes directly from GoPro, but I think it actually comes from a company who are authorized by GoPro to do some um, refurbishment work for them. Um, so I ordered that a couple of days ago. It's just arrived. And I thought, well, you know, it's an old camera. It's, it's a GoPro 6 Black. You know, it's been out a few years now, but to me, it's new. And to my channel, it's new. So I thought I'd just do a little boxing. So this is the camera I've been using to now. It's a Sony AS50. It's a it's a cracking little camera, it really is. I've used this all my all my videos you've seen so far. Um, the battery on it is phenomenal. I can you go out for, in fact, when I did my hundred mile bike ride, when I you know I was out for seventy eight hours, I think it was, I still had loads of battery when I got back. It just never runs out of battery. It's just absolutely fantastic. I've just got a little wind thing on there to stop for the microphone, because it's, it's got a stereo microphone on the front here. Um, but it's phenomenal. It really is good quality. Yeah, it's got a Zeiss, that's a pronounced Zeiss lens in it. Really, really high quality camera, really good quality. Um, and I bought this second hand off CEX, fuck, I remember how much it was now, it was about 60, 70 pounds, something like that. It was very cheap and it's been brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Really is good camera. Um, got Im image stabilization and everything, but it's getting on a bit. It's a few years old when I bought it, do you know what I mean? I've had it quite a bit as well. I've dropped this a couple of times as well. I just probably saw my videos and it's a hard little thing. It really is. Recommend this to anybody. It's fantastic. They make really good cameras to Sony. And as you know, well, Sony um, put you know make a lot of the processors, not the process, the chips, the image, um, the image sensors. Sorry, image sensors. They make them for a lot of cameras. Um, you never know they might make them for GoPros, but they do make loads of um, image sensors for a lot of companies. And here it is. So just comes in a covered box because obviously it's it's um, not a not the original GoPro box. One hundred and sixty pound this was for a GoPro Eight Plus. GoPro Eight Plus? No, GoPro Eight Black, not Plus. Um, but um, it's just arrived today. Comes in quite a swanky little box. I actually thought it was just going to be a cardboard box. I didn't actually think it was going to be um, you know like any kind of GoPro kind of box, but as you can see, there it is. So this is the GoPro 8. Hope it's focusing all right now for you. Um, and as I say, I know this is not cycling related, but I use obviously cameras on my bike and you might see this, you might notice it's a different picture or a different camera. So I thought I'd just show you what I bought anyway. If anybody's interested, you might want to buy one yourselves. And as I say, I'll put the link up for you if you want to buy it. So let's have a look, see what we've got in here. I think you don't get a lot to do with GoPros, if I remember right. Some cameras you get lots of gear with them, but GoPros, I don't think you get much with them, do you? And I've never been a, I've never been one of these people who has to buy the latest and greatest, as you know from me, from my previous videos. Um, so I think you get two batteries actually with this, which is which is nice. Um, I don't think the battery lasts as long as it did on my Sony, but if you get two of them, that might be nice. Instructions there. And obviously, a little user book, and then a few bits and bobs. Okay, just a little update. We're now a few days later. I've had the GoPro a few days. I've tested it out. I've tried it out, and a um, few problems. Definitely a few problems. Um, I wouldn't connect to the computer. 
Um, I couldn't transfer my files. I had to take the memory card to transfer the files, which a bit of a fiddle on, but it wasn't a major issue, really. I could get around that. The major issue was I charged it up once. Uh, the, the, the batteries charged, two batteries, came with two batteries. I charged them up once. That was fine. Tried the camera out, went back to try the, the, um, to charge the batteries up again, and it wouldn't charge. Just refused to charge. Um, so the, the GoPro 6 Black is going back. Um, and I've got something new. Uh, I found a new camera. I found a DJ Osmo action camera, and I've got that today. I'm going to unbox that instead. Um, this one is actually a pre-owned one from CEX. It's the same place I got me Sony, me old Sony from. Um, and you, you get like a couple of years warranty with their stuff and stuff. It's second hand, you know, so I won't open it now. Hopefully it'll be good condition stuff. You can see with me as I open it. Um, but um, I've had some stuff from them in the past and they're usually pretty good. And as I say, it's got a couple of years warranty. It's actually got a longer warranty than I probably would have had from the manufacturers. So I'll open that now and uh, and see how we go. And hopefully this one's going to be a lot better than the uh, the GoPro was. It's got really good reviews online. Um, it's got a front facing screen, so it's got a few extra bits and bobs that the uh, GoPro 6 Black doesn't have. Um, I think this is quite on par with the GoPro 8, to be honest with you, when you, when you look at reviews. So we'll, sort of, we'll shall see. So I'll open that up now and let's have a look at this one. Eh? Let's, have, let's hope we have better luck with this one. So I've got a, just a generic box here, obviously, from... CEX, so let's have a look. I don't know what this comes with, it doesn't come with a lot, I don't think. A bit like the GoPro, they don't come with a lot of stuff. But I'm hoping that it comes with its, um, with its, um, like cage, you know, there's a cage that you need to connect. I don't know why these, these action cameras like the GoPro and this one's the same, doesn't just have a, um, um, a mount, you know, a, a tripod mount on the bottom. Instead, they have all these silly case things, don't they? Let's have a look. I think it's in its box, actually. So that's a good sign. It's well packaged. Well packaged that looks. I think it's in its box. That's good, that's good. There it is, yeah. It's in its box, because the last one I got um, from CEX, that me Sony camera, me, me, me little Sony here, which I've got inside its little wind wind protection thing there. Um, that one didn't come in a proper box. In fact, there's the box it came in. That's how it came, just like that from CEX, which is fine, you know, that's a second hand camera, you know, it did as fine, a little waterproof hose, which I never use. Um, I just put this on, like I say, to stop the wind and any wind noise. I'll have to do the same with this. I mean, actually, I bought one of these um, to fit the to fit the GoPro as well. Probably want to fit the GoPro, so that's no use, is it? Unless I can Jimmy rig it to fix this. So yeah, so this looks pretty good, Nick, doesn't it? Apparently, on the website, it says in good condition. Um, not mint. They have three categories. They have mint condition, good condition, and okay condition. I think the C one is. And this one's apparently in good condition, but it actually comes in this box, so I'll put the camera down, I'll open this box up because I can do it with one handed and let's see how we'll go. I've just took the camera out of its box there and I'm not sure why CX has graded this as being good um, instead of mint because it looks absolutely mint to me. I mean if you look, you can see the screen there, if I take it and move it, I mean that is absolutely mint, there's not a mark on it. A mark on either of the screens. It's got front facing screen on this as well. Um, and one nice little touch that these Osmos have is, I don't know if I can do it there, there. You're going to do this, this um, cover for the lens. So if you get any scratches on here, you can just remove that and put another one on. Um, and they're not very expensive to buy a new one of these rather than having to buy a new lens. Because I understand on the latest GoPros, the GoPros 8, um, they don't even, you can't remove this, you know. Once you get scratched, that's it. Your camera is trashed, so unless you can remove this, and you can put um, and ND filters on, no natural natural density filters on, so um, you know for for bright low um, skies and things like that, you know you can uh, help with that kind of thing if you wanted to do that. But that's um, that's phenomenal quality. That really is like brand new, really is top quality. 
top quality. Um, and it does have the cage there as well, which I was worried about. There's the cage there. Uh, I actually took it off to show you the camera better. Does come with the cage, and then you get all the accessories as well. I mean, even the even the cable's still got its plastic on it. You know, like a brand new wear, uh, brand new wear uh, one you'd buy. You know, and all these have been not been used. There's instruction manual in here. Um, I suppose the box has got a little bit of a crease in it. Maybe it's, maybe that's why the graded has been good rather than mint. But it's basically, you know, it's brand new. It's like brand new. If I bought this, you know, from the shop, this is exactly how it would turn up. So very happy with that, especially for the uh, price difference, you know. I think these are about 330 something like that, 330 pounds, depending on where you buy them from. You know, 180 it cost me. Um, well... 140 actually by the time I uh, time I had a, used a voucher I had a voucher for some stuff I traded into the CX ages and ages ago so I used that voucher online and got it for a 140 so yeah I'm very happy with that very happy amazing quality amazing quality so yeah so just a quick video there just to uh, unbox my new camera and uh, hopefully hopefully it's going to be better than the uh, the GoPro was and it's all so that's it there you know, with the Osmo. Uh, so try it out probably this week sometime. So no doubt soon and soon enough you'll see um, a video with me using it. Because at the moment the weather's a lot better outside. It's brightened up a lot. We've got no snow now, and it's about eight degrees today, seven or eight degrees. So uh, the weather's improved remarkably since uh, since last week. So hopefully I'm going to get out soon um, and uh, try this out. So yeah. Just a quick little video there just to show you my new toy that I'm going to be using for my videos and uh, hopefully you will see the benefit of it. It's supposed to have good um, image stabilization on this. Rocksteady, I think it's called Rocksteady image stabilization. So we'll give this a go, see what it's like, and you'll hopefully see the results very, very soon. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves. See you very soon. Bye-bye.